Bundesliga season in 16 days' time. For Bayern, it's potentially a last chance for fringe players such as Michael Cuisance or Joshua Zerxi to stake a claim for more minutes this season. Meanwhile, academy graduates Josip Stanisic in defence, Torben Rhein in midfield and Malik Tillman on the wing get another rare run-out in a Bayern starting side captained by Eric Maxim Chupomoting. And like Nagelsmann, Gladbach boss Adi Hütter is shorn of several star players but has more first-team regulars at his disposal. Goalkeeper Tobias Sippel has overcome a hand injury to feature, while in midfield, captain Christoph Kramer is back on the pitch after impressing as a guest expert on German television Euro, during Euro 2020. Gladbach have been hit by a spate of injuries in pre-season and with Alassane player the latest to be sidelined with a knee injury, 19-year-old Mika Schruers leads the line for the it's Bayern who get the ball rolling in this pre-season friendly. Uh, some may say it's a dress rehearsal for this season's Bundesliga curtain raiser, but this evening at the... An early chance here for the home side. It is to promoting, and he went around the wall. And Zippel didn't gamble. For now, it's a neat touch from Joe Scally, the young American, and a nice pass to open up the play out wide for Keenan Be Bennett. Only a few white shirts ahead of him. Bennett goes it alone, sees his shot blocked. A one on one with Richards, twisting, turning, gets away from him as well. Still Scally. Ah, oh, tried to bend it with his unfavoured left foot. Benesch delivers. A good delivery as well. And Kramer chances his arm. Well, he doesn't score many goals, Christoph Kramer. And of those 11 goals, it's arguably one that would be the 12th that is he's most famous for, which is an own goal against Dortmund for now. Malik Tillman one-on-one -on -one with Bayer. He's got the pace to get past Bayer. Is hauled down, chance still alive. Turksy side netting. And questions being asked of Robert Hartmann, the referee. And it did look like Tweed's best he could, but really was hauled to the ground by Patrick Hermann there. Free kick, Cuisance. Oh, that's a lovely delivery! And it just needed the final touch. Tongi Nianzu was there, fresh from scoring in the two-all draw against Ajax. He... <laughs> He worked under during his time with Red Bull Salzburg. Rosa used him well last season. Oh, there's a chance here for Gladbach. Paulsen put the ball into the mix. In the end, it was Omar. Christoph Kramer wins the ball well in midfield. Finds space for Joe Scali to attack. Clipping the ball in there, and then over Yannick! Broken the deadlock here at the Allianz Arena. Delightful delivery from the young American Joe Scali. And Gladbach won the numbers game. And Hannes Wolf peeled off the marker at the back post. He was unmarked, but produces a very tidy and composed first time finish. So on the hour mark. Well, the pressure applied by Gladbach, a mistake, and Hannes Wolf denied his brace by a great save from Ron Torben Hoffman, but Bayern. Since the wholesale changes made by Julian Nagelsmann, 10 players. And the finesse on that pass from Lawrence was absolutely delightful. Perfect weight on the ball. 
nice little touch from Vidovic and he fashioned the chance himself in the end drags the effort wide Bayern claimed the title of most Bundesliga matches played Bremen have nine, nine, 1,934 to their name Bayern currently with 1,908 by the end of the season, they'll have eight more Bundesliga matches to their name than Gladbach to make the changes, but we're going to wait until after the corner from Serge Gnabry. And the good delivery, and Lawrence was in there, closest to it. Lawrence again! Doesn't get his head to the ball at the vital moment when he was just begging for the final touch. The booth. And look at this, Serge Gnabry now with space. He's got Matika. In support, the Serge Gnabry looking to go it alone. Closed down for the German international. But now, Kisera finds Koronos. The angle is tight, and he went for the cheeky finish between the legs. In the end, Ron Torben Hoffmann, a man from the Republic of Ireland, born in Dusseldorf, though, in Germany. Oh, cheeky ball! Chance to alone! Gladbach double their lead at the Allianz Arena. It's another pre-season friendly that's not quite going according to the script for Bayern and Julian Nagelsmann. But Adi Hütter is seeing some of his young stars steal the show here in Munich. And second half substitute Michael Wenzel is the man to double their lead.